Guys, I found a version that's not so faded and it's right, it's from the Culture Revolution. So it says, use Mao Zedong thought to arm your brain, to arm your mind. <laughs> Tuandixia is this awesome historical village about a two hour drive west of Beijing. First settled in the Ming Dynasty, visiting this well preserved village is like taking a step back in time. So we've almost arrived at uh, Tuandixia village and we're driving on the road and it's very bumpy. But there's so much history here, we're right in the countryside. It's your boy, Jagger Umiwan. Just arrived at the village, Twandisia. Just gonna have some lunch first and then go exploring. But uh, yeah, this place is awesome. There's so much history, so many old buildings here. Uh, we're just in a restaurant now, gonna go get a feed and then uh, check out all the history and the culture. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. So, Jagger Umiwan is here in Twandisia. That's one. Yeah, I can't get the pronunciation right, but we're here in this Ming Dynasty village and it is awesome. There are a few tourists around, like myself, but uh, these 400, 500 year old buildings is absolutely amazing, it's beautiful. So I'm going to take you guys around and look at some old, authentic Chinese buildings, Chinese culture. Stay tuned. <laughs> So I've just made friends with this, uh, this fine young gentleman here who's chilling out doing some English study. He's just invited me up onto this roof of this hotel and uh, you can see behind me is the old village. Like it's such a, such a beautiful view from up here. Wow. down at all these old buildings, old homes, and uh, it's just beautiful, I love it. I can imagine, you know, some Ming Dynasty, Qing Dynasty soldiers marching down the street instead of all these cars, you know, just soaking up the history, it's great. Your boy has just ascended up a nice view down onto all these kind of roofs and all this Chinese architecture. So behind me is a, an old Chinese wall. Might not look like much, but I think it's very cool. Guys, I just I just stumbled across this little gate here. This is so old school. Take a look. Just at the local village's little temple where they would uh, bring offerings for deceased relatives. So there's old mate behind me, uh, and there's some cigarettes, fruit, and a bottle of coke there. So it's you know, just a small little temple for a tiny little ancient village, but it's it's amazing. Behind me, there's a grinder for wheat, and for flour, and for rice as well. Probably I'm not quite sure, but also what's important is up there. There's some faded red Chinese characters. And I'm I've got a feeling that that could be from the Cultural Revolution. It could have been one of the slogans, one of Mao's slogans painted up there for the villagers to see. Guys, I found a version that's not so faded and it's right, it's from the Cultural Revolution. So it says, use Mao Zedong thought to arm your brain, to arm your mind. So here we go, some authentic Cultural Revolution stuff. Villages out here. Swan DC 
Our village is awesome. It's just a combination of windy paths and steps, twisty turn with little streets, little alleys. This village nestled in the hills and the mountains. And uh, it's just, it's so cool. I love it. Hello. So that's the character for this village, the name, Swan. And uh, yeah, it's been amazing. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Jay Groovy on out.